Hey followers of my channel, my name is Marina, I'm talking to you from Argentina and today I come with the unboxing of a new line uh, which is an Argentinian line, Povic is its name. They say they don't uh, produce uh, clones but, uh, or dupes, but uh, they do it. Um, some of them are a little bit different and I don't know the lasting they have because I have to try them on my skin. Uh, and then I will produce a review. But today I wanted to show you the ones I have bought. For men, I bought this one, which is called uh, Pove Gold. For men, it's the dupe of One Million by Paco Rabanne. We tested this with my husband a few minutes ago. Uh, it's uh, really uh, very similar to uh, One Million by Paco Rabanne. This is the bottle. The bottles for men are uh, very similar, all the same. Uh, I bought only two, but they are the same. They look exactly similar. Uh, bottles for women are different. This is Nina, Nina Ricci. The name is Take It Easy. Uh, they wanted to write Take It Easy, but they wrote it together and that's the, the pronunciation of the word. This is the bottle of Take It Easy, and then I will try it on my skin and will tell you in one video if it lasts how many hours if it is similar or not to Nina the classical Nina by Nina Ricci this one is uh, the copy or the dupe of fashion by Giorgio Armani for women look at the bottle this is the bottle it smells delicious but then I will review it uh, what I like about these bottles is that all of them uh, came in 50 or 60 milliliters, no more than that, and we can take this in our bath. This is uh, Femme Sensation, uh, the dupe of Nina Leo by Nina Ricci. Uh, the bottle is different, but uh, I smell the perfume and it is really very, very similar to the original one. To the designer Nina Liu. Mm, here we are. We are Barbarella, Barbarella Women. Uh, this perfume is the dupe of Kenzo Amor. Kenzo Amor. Uh, look at the bottle. It's a different bottle. I don't know if it, it, if the smell is exact or not, but I will try it. Uh, all, all of them are very similar. I must tell you that I have been surprised because of the price of this perfume. This is Povic Rosé and I love this perfume when I smell it. it it's the dupe of 212 Big Rosé by Carolina Herrera and I also like the bottle. I love this bottle and it smells very similar to 212 Big Rosé by Carolina Herrera. I suppose that this perfume will last on my skin uh, for many hours. I don't know it exactly, but when I smell them, I notice if they are pure alcohol or if they have uh, scents that will last on my skin. Another I wanted to get was Pove Red, which is the uh, tube of Red Door by uh, Elizabeth Arden. Uh, it's a, this is a perfume I like a lot look at this it's beautiful it has uh, the spray and, a, and then a cover uh, red door is very expensive nowadays and this is very similar i tried it a few minutes ago another one i bought for women is persea which is the dupe of olympia by paco raban persea by povic uh, all this is the same line this is the bottle look at the bottle it's a nice bottle carrying our bag uh, in the, I will tell you about how, how long it lasts it also it this has 55 uh, 55, uh, 55 milliliters pardon. Um, oh my god I almost broke it this is the dupe of uh, good girl by Carolina Herrera the black uh, shoe this is the ball they don't copy the bottles, right? You can see they copy just uh, some design of uh, boxes uh, and the name. 
but uh, somebody told me this is very good so I will test it carefully and then I will let you know if they last on my skin or not and I always tell you the truth you know nobody pays me nobody gave me the samples I had to pay them I had to pay for them this is Povic for men uh, this is the copy of Invictus by Paco Raman and as you can see the bottle is exactly the same as the other one uh, if we don't read the, the, the name, they give you the similarities. We, if we don't smell them, we don't know, you know, because of the bottles. Because the bottles are totally different and also the names. Um, this morning I was revi uh, reviewing a perfume and, and I said that it's the view of Miss, uh, Miss Yor because they say it's the view of uh, Miss Kenzo, uh, Kenzo flower tap. But when I compare the notes and I compare the perfumes, and I have Miss Dior and I have I have Kenzo tap, the original ones, I decided that it was the view of Miss Dior. And I, I'm sorry if I don't agree with our, the, the people who, who produce it, but it's not the the view of, for me. It's not the view of flower tap. And uh, this is Angel. Uh, the copy of Angel by Freddie Mugler. You know, I have many dupes, and this is the one I love most. Uh, it's produced by Ives Angel. You know, I have shown to you. I have shown this perfume many times because I love it. I smell this one, but um, I think, well, before trying it, I think it, this is not similar to Angel. That's my opinion. I have to try. Um, perhaps I didn't give that perfume the opportunity it deserves because I tried and I had many perfumes on my uh, on another uh, part of my arm. So perhaps I have to try it a lot. Um, this one is Free Love. Uh, the name uh, doesn't say anything, but it's a copy of Lady Say by uh, Say Jackie. This is for my daughter because she collects them and collects the copies and uh, the originals. She loves them. Uh, I will try it on her skin and then I will let you know if it is a, a good look or not. Um, last but not least, uh, my favorite perfume and the dupe my, made by Poppy, which is called Bella. Uh, Bella means uh, it's, a, it's a dupe of uh, La Vie Belle by Lancome. This is the bottle. I like the bottle. It produces a nice bottle. And the perfume is very similar. Very similar. But as I told you, I don't know how much it will last on my skin. But I will try. I will try one by one and give them the time to know how much they last, how many hours they last on my skin and then I will sell them off uh, to my friends of course. Well if you like this video uh, give me a like and subscribe to my channel and uh, see you soon with the next idea bye bye